Race to get confirmed cases under control in Arizona is top priority, especially for business owners forced to shut down. Governor Doug Ducey extended closures for several industries a few weeks ago. Now health benchmarks are providing new hope for companies that want to reopen. Team 12's Matt Uris is live outside the Alamo Theater in Chandler. So Matt, what sort of benchmarks do businesses have to meet at this point? Good morning, Rachel. We'll get to those benchmarks in just a second. First, I do want to say to give some perspective here, this is one of just 38 businesses that have been cleared to reopen by Arizona's Department of Health Services. The agency's reviewing applications uh, for from businesses that were closed by Governor Doug Ducey back on June 29th. Specifically, we know these well. We're talking gyms, fitness centers, bars and nightclubs, water parks and movie theaters. Reopenings now will be phased based on positivity rates in the type of business applying. These are some of the specific questions you had, Rachel. For example, bars without food have to remain closed until a 3% positivity rate is achieved. Even then, though, capacity is limited to 50%. For another example here, gyms can reopen at 25% capacity once a positivity rate of 5 to 10% is achieved. These standards must be met for two weeks. DHS has more than 600 applications pending right now. It says that its agency is working as fast as possible on this. Again, just 38 businesses open at, the at this time. We do have that list right now up on 12news.com if you're interested. For now, we're live in Chandler. Matt Uris, Today in AZ.